YouTube.com forward slash Lord. Subscribe to the channel for gaming news, updates, discussion, and live streams. Signing off. Hey guys, this is Moogalore here and I'm back again with another video. Um, this video is pretty much a follow-up to a video I did about a month or two ago. It was pretty much me talking about why Nintendo Online service is just garbage. And it seemed like the Nintendo had pretty much finally answered one of my problems. And that was pretty much be able to invite uh, your friends into your game sessions or jump into your friends game sessions. So it seems like with version 9.0, uh, which is an update that just came out. If you guys haven't done it yet, I advise you to update your, your Nintendo Switch so you're able to do that. And now you're able to pretty much create your own sessions, online sessions. You're able to invite your friends to your games. And it's about time that Nintendo had done it. I don't know why it took this long. It shouldn't have taken a year to put a simple feature um, as that. But I guess I can just still say, Nintendo, thank you. I appreciate it. Now there's more things and more quality of life features that you should be able to implement next um with your online service to make this a full complete online service if you guys still haven't checked out yet um nintendo had uh recently released the snes service so now you can play a, um at least 20 snes titles which i think are super fun i was looking forward to the snes it, the nes uh, service was pretty much uh a meh uh, to me, I really didn't care too much for it, and I am pretty much haven't even tried any of the NES games. It, that wasn't something that I was really waiting for, and to me, it really didn't justify um, the online service at all. If that's what, pe if, if that was the selling point of the online service, um, instead of just being able to play with your friends online. But the SNES was something I was definitely waiting for, and I had the opportunity to play a Link to the Past, and I, it was been a while since I played a Link to the Past, and me jumped, and when I jumped into it played it and that nostalgia just kicked in man I, I just couldn't sit down and stop playing it I played it for a few hours and I, I love what they've done with this and I love the fact that you're able to play the multiplayer SNES games too online with your friends and everything so I think that's pretty cool so it looks like the online service that Nintendo have going on is shaping up somewhat but Nintendo really have to keep the ball rolling they have to keep it going because we do need better quality of life features added to the system and I just don't understand why it just took them this long so I'm glad that they finally addressed this now they pretty much have to do away with this Nintendo uh, Switch app online app I just really think it's unnecessary we shouldn't need an app and use our cell phone to pretty much communicate uh, with our friends and be able to set up uh, games and sessions with our friends and everything using this stupid app I just think it's stupid what I think it could be useful for is keeping up with some of the stats that's going on and pretty much having that me verse type of community but on your phone I think that'd be pretty cool um, for the cell phone but as far as communication and everything everything should be done on the console itself Nintendo look at your competition look what your competition is doing and follow it they already set the blueprint for it it's easy just do it you don't have to be that unique in order to set yourself apart from the rest of the competition. Nintendo, you're still awesome. You still have your first, your great first party titles. And now you have third party titles coming on to this great system. So Nintendo, just stop with this next year or maybe in the next couple of months. Hopefully we see some more quality of life changes for this console because I just think the Nintendo Switch is a very good is a very good console. I enjoy this console. I really enjoy what they're doing with this. So Nintendo. Just keep doing what you're doing and just keep improving, but you have to pick up the pace. It, like You can't be lagging or lagging behind when it comes to something as simple as this. But that pretty much wraps up this video. I just want to hear your thoughts on this. What do you think about the online service for Nintendo Switch? And do you think that Nintendo is finally going to get it together? And would you prefer uh, everything done with the console itself when it comes to voice chat and communicating with your um, with your friends and everything as far as the quality of life is concerned i definitely want to hear your thoughts in the comment section below don't forget to hit the subscribe button and subscribe to my youtube channel and if you want to be notified for more nintendo news and updates on this channel hit the notification bell to be notified this is moving lord signing off see you game fiends later peace out It looks like you reached the end of the video. Well, while you're at it, check out some of my other discussion videos by clicking on the annotations below. And don't forget to follow me on other social media platforms to stay up to date with future content. Signing off.